Okay, good Bach. We're up to the Mishnah on Daf Lamid Amid Beis. Mishnah Daf Lamid Amid Beis. Says the Mishnah. Interesting. We learned the Elam Mitzvahs. Now the Gemara asked the Mishnah asked the question: Ezehi Aveda. What exactly is an Aveda? It's like very funny. Okay, look at the bottom Tzvahs. Ezo Aveda sheyavin that you, it's understandable sheina bailum yoidim sheishan that the bailum don't know what's there. In other words, you you can see from the the Mitzvahs of the animal the state it's in that it's 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 an Aveda. Now you can see from the status of the animal. That, that it's an Aveda. Who, who is that? What's the Chamor a Pura Royan Bederech? If you see a donkey or a Pura, they are grazing on the way. Ain't that, Aveda. That's not an Aveda. And you're not high to return it because the, it's not lost. If the owner's not around, but if it's grazing on the Derech, it's not lost. If it's grazing on the Derech, it's not lost. Now, I'm pointing out now, like the Gemara will, that these are two milers Royan versus Ratza versus running, and on the derech versus in the keren. Okay? So the roya derech are two milas to return it. Roy, that that don't call, don't leave, just leave it. That it's roya, it's pasturing, and it's in the derech. Chamor bekelev hafuchin, if you see a chamor, and kelev is its saddle, hafuchin, they are turned over. Or, para rotsin bein akramin, this is the contract, right? This is the para that is running in between the vineyard. So in the vineyard, it, it, it's not good because it can get all scratched up. And it's running rather than what? Then roya, then pasturing. Harizu Aveda, that would be an Aveda. The Gemara is going to question, what about the middle status? What about if it's roya in the Kramim or if it's it, or if it's, yeah. it's Ratzah Bederech? The Gemara is going to go ahead and go those two other variables. Hechzira Ubarcha, Hechzira Ubarcha, you turn the animal and runs away, you turn the animal and runs away. Afilu arba b'chamisha pamim even four or five times. Chayv l'atzira shnemar hashek to shivim because it says the lashon of hashek to shivim. So where exactly is the is the limit from from the words hashek hashek to shivim? I saw a pshat. It's just repeating the word twice. It means you have to return it more than once. And that's that's the pashup shot. It's not. We'll see, okay. We'll see later on. We're gonna we're gonna go into it. We're gonna we're gonna go into it later on. Pashup to sheep, and we'll see that. Yes, yes, Hesh. What what does it mean? It's in it's in the vineyard. It, it, obviously, it's not the owner of the vineyard knows that's not my chamar. So and and the owner why would it, why would his chamar be in in the other guy's vineyard? Again, so it's so it's, it's an it, that it's, if, if it's in the vineyard, it's an aveda. You're right. It's yeah, okay. Aveda. It's aveda. If it's in the vineyard, it's an aveda. You know, not that it's getting scratched or anything. It's, you know, exactly. it's, it's, yeah. it's, it's an aveda. Now, if it's the owners, there's no shaila about it. Right. You're, you're you're in your vineyard and you see an animal. The question yes, not mine. A har Harold, good, it's not yours. Are you chive to did the owner leave it there and he's coming to get it? Or you chive to return it. That has a din of an aveda. That's the Mars okay. question. Okay. That's the more I want to know. That's the okay. Mars Okay. Uh when the when the person is returning the Aveda, he's losing money. That's the time when he's busy with this Aveda, he's gonna lose a seller. When he returns the Aveda, he can't ask for total recompensation of the amount he lost. He pays him like a poil, like a worker. And we'll see what that means in the Gemara. In Yeshan Bezdin, however, if there's a Bezdin, there are three people. Masim, if they bezdin, he can go ahead and make a condition in front of bezdin to get total recompensation. Right? Says Rashi. And Yeshan bezdin, and Noyach loy litroyach yoisa, if he wants to be matriach himself more, kedei la harboys schar, they in a chafetz li bottom in malachtoi, mayase. In other words, if he wants to get, get more than just the kapoil bottle, then he can make it to Nai bezdin. I said total recompensation, that not necessarily is true. It means if he, kapoil bottle means, as we're going to see in the Gemara, how much should a person get paid not to do this work? But this, so now, let's say the guy wants more than that. He wants he doesn't want to get what do we what do we call um, when a person uh, when a person when a person's out of a job? What do they get? What's the what's it called? Unemployment. Unemployment, right? He doesn't want to get unemployment. He wants to get he wants to get something, right? He wants to get something, so he should make a condition in front of three people. And then 
if they me yes nishalai kaidem if he doesn't have uh if he doesn't have a person who he can go ahead there's not people there right uh, that that he can go ahead on and and make this kanai and he doesn't want to take a loss he should be oisig of malacha and leave the aveda he's not chayiv to go ahead and lose his schar because of the aveda so this is a fascinating halacha right right so fact it says fs kilo kilo yecha you saw guys the top of the block Top line of this plot. F Amar Rav F S K Lo Yechav Ha Evyon Shel Chok Chaydim Shel Kol Adam. You come first. So in other words, just because you see an Aveda automatically, even though it's 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 totally Kvayda, you're not a an Adam Chashev that you can leave it there. You have to make a a, a cheshbon. If I'm going to be Isaac with this Aveda, is it going to cost me? And if it's it's going to cost you, you're able to go ahead and leave it, and you won't be over this or Leisuch Lesalim. It's very interesting that. Shabbos Aveda is a mitzvah, but it's very much contingent upon Hilchas Chayshim Mishpat. It's very much contingent upon Hilchas Mominus over here. And you have to make a cheshbin. If it's going to cost me a loss to deal with this, then, then I come first. Then I come first. Very, very fascinating. Very fascinating. If no Shem Bezden to go ahead and make that condition that you want to get more than unemployment, then you can say, you can, you can go ahead and say, I'm going me yisna shaloi kaidem. That's it. You just you just leave the leave the Aveda. You leave it. You leave it. You know, you know, you, you leave it. That's it. You leave the Aveda and, and you don't deal with it. Okay. Now the Mishnah said, Ezu Aveda. Now, when you, you open it up, you begin to think, one second, I, I'm learning a whole peric, and you're asking me, Ezu Aveda, you're waking up now. All the things we just mentioned. It's not an Aveda. Come on, guys. You, you, you how many pro, how many dafim in? Right, since Daf Chav Chav Aleph Chav Beis, you ten blood in, and you, you, how many Avedas did you list? These, these are not Avedas. Says the Gemara, no, that's not what it means. I'm Rav Yehuda Hachi Kama. Here's what the Mishnah means: Ezehi Klal Aveda Shu Chayiv Ba. What is the what is the definition of Aveda that it shows that what that the Baal is not around? Rashi says Stam Aveda Shemuchachas that it shows Shehi Shem. Shalom mitas bailam. How do you, the one that you know that it's not there, and the, that the owner doesn't know about it? How do you know about that? So now, matzachamor upara royim b'derech. You see them royim b'derech. Ain't zu aveda. That's not an aveda because roy is normal and the derech is normal. And you're not chayiv to go ahead and 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 be oisik with it. Chamor v'kelav. However, if you see a chamor with 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 saddle falling off, hafuchin or para v'roitz and benakramim. Or it's a para and it's running. It's very interesting that by chamar or par, he doesn't say chamar. There's like just para v'ratzah bein bein karamim. So here you have two chesreinus. It's running and it's running in the in the karam where it can get get messed up. Harizu aveda umechayivah. That's an aveda. Okay, so that's the brisa that elaborates upon it. Red gemara ula oilam. In other words, if you see that animal there every single day, you mean to tell me that what that the owner left it there every single day? Ula oilam. In other words. Good, good once or twice, but every, all the time. At some point, you have to realize that the owner doesn't know about it. Three days. If the animal is three days in the derech, guys, if you see a roi bederech three days, right? After three days, you can go ahead and take it because you be sure the owner doesn't know about it. Now, heki dummy, the guy wants to qualify the statement. If it's roi bederech in the nighttime where it's not normal to leave an animal out, I feel the shaitan nami. Even one hour, it, you should be chayav lahachlis to take it. And ibi yamama. And if it's during the daytime, I feel two nami even more than three days because it's normal to be there. So the gemara wants to know this three days is kind of funny. I can be qualified by the time of day rather than the amount of days. At the time of day, I should be able to qualify whether the owner, the or the owner, <laughs> the owner, or the owner uh, knows about it. I feel like Sricha, the Havi Chazile, he sees it when he gets up, right before daytime. Or he sees it right by nightfall. So, in other words, this, not during the, right early in the morning, he sees it three days in a row, or night. So, since it's early in the morning or before it gets dark, it's not subject to the, the daytime or the nighttime, the extremes. And therefore, Tilsi Yamin Amina Nisrum Yisramila. For three days, it's possible that it happened that just at this time it was there, the nafgot, right? And then it went out. Fei, but more than three days, 
at dusk or or in, in the morning, early in the morning, for example, then what? Then then uh, it would be it would be an aveda. The same which substantiate this din of Rav Yehuda. Matzah talis the kardom basracha. If you find a talis or 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 an, an, an axe in asracha, it's a derech where a, a, a lot of people are. Upara roitzah bein akramim and a para running among the kramim. Right, you have both chesroinus. It's running bein akramim. Harizu aveda. Talis b'tzad geder kadim b'tzad geder. If you see a talis at the side of a fence or an axe at the side of a fence, upara roya bein bein. Now the gro is is goyris roya bein haasovim, not roya bein akramim. Would give again. It's going to be a shail in a second. This is the kramim is a chesarin and roya is a milo. So he's got the gro is goyris roya bein haasovim. The grass ainzu aveda. That's not an aveda. Gimel yomim zeachaseh. Here's the raya. If you see it three consecutive days, it's an Aveya, Veda. Other din, so that was the right, guys. Tanya Nami Hachi, the three days. Another din, Roya Mayim Sheshtufim, you see water coming, cascading, Uboyim, Harizu Gedder Bifneim, let's say a levy, able to put bags to stop the water from coming and save the guy's field, then you can go ahead and do that. Harizu Gedder Bifneim, put a gather up in front of them to save the field. Okay, now Rava, on that last din, this is, Rav is not. This is Rava, the Rava, Rashi points out, this is Rava saying as a separate entity. I'm a Rava. It says, karka, to include, to go ahead, as we just saw, to return karka. If you see, able to go ahead and save a person's field by putting some dam up, then do it. Amalei Rav Chananya, le Rava. Hayi de I have a, a b'risa that's a riot to you. So Rav Chananya is going to be a riot to Rava, who didn't know what karka. That's how the Gemara knew it was the Milsa because he first bring in the Brisa. You know, if you learn it literally, it looks like Rub is commenting on the Brisa. Then Rav Hananya goes ahead and brings the Brisa as what? As a proof. So obviously Rav could be speaking about the Brisa. He's bringing it as a proof now. So he said to him, Rav said to Rav Hananya, it's not a riot from there. It's speaking where there are piles in the field, and you're saving the water for the piles, not necessarily for the karka. What's the chiddush? Like any other word, aveda leitzricha. This be oimim leitzricha laara. The oimim that need the ground. I'm not exactly sure the mitzias of this. If they're hurry, they're cut. What do you mean they need the ground for? An oimer, right? In other words, you, you, there's no have a meaning. You have to cut the grain to save it. I'm not sure. So my detainment, keeping the tzricha la ara, since it needs the ara, ki gufa the ara dummy and what, and you won't have to save it, kamash malon, that you have to save it. So uh, you have no right that it's speaking about saving the ground, it could be speaking about saving the oimrim. Okay, as a, a, a prelude to the next piece of Gemara, roya bederach, guys, is two milas. Roya, it's grazing as opposed to running, ratza, baderach as opposed to the kromim. What about if you have one mila? It's roya, it's roya bekromim, or it's Ratza Baderech. Why would it didn't be over there? And from the Mishnah, the Brisa, you seem to have two inferences that are conflicting. From the, we see, we can see it, we apparently have two inferences that are are conflicting. Let's see. Hagufa Kasha. I'm what you said. Royan Baderech. Both Milas, Royan and Baderech. Einzu Aveda. Roya Baderech. Hudloya Aveda. Because you have both Milas. But if it's running bederech or where you only have one mila, then it would be an aveda that you, you would be hired to go ahead and, and take the animal. And the pura is running between the kramim. They have these two chesroinis. Harizu aveda. But if it's rotsa bederech, only has one. Only only. It only has the Ratsa, or Royan Ben Akramim, it only has the Ben Akramim, Ainzu Aveda. So, how do you go ahead, Rod, and, and reconcile the two? Um, Rabaya, okay, don't make the inference you made, but Yagav of Rayai. Let its friend, let it literally, the thunder will let you know it's raining. Yagav of Rayai means the thunder will let you know it's raining. Tana, right? Right? Okay. Yeah, we got a mukas. Tana, roya bederech. So yagel of roya means one's going to f- on the other. Roya roya bederech means you have two milas. The loy avi aveda. 
who are din, not only roya bederech, who are din roya ben akramim. As long as it's roya, even though it's ben akramim, it's not. It's not what. It's not. A, it's not a not a chesarin. Hana rotsa ben akramim, the havi aveda, who are din rotsa bederech. In other words, the main criteria is 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 the is the the, the, the roya. But when it's roya, it's running, not the location, but what it's doing, whether it's running or not. Amay rava iyagel avrei. Listen, Kilisa, the Koshkin Chimirasa, learn the Kula first and then the Chumra first. So, what's the Kula? Listen, Rotsa Baderech, the Havi Aveda, the Koshkin Rotsa Ben Akramim. Listen, Roya Ben Akramim, the Havi Aveda, the Koshkin Roya Baderech. Elama Rava, so we have the Stira. Again, in the first one, it's Mashma that it's Aveda, the second one, it's, it's first not an Aveda, it is an Aveda, the second one, it's not an Aveda. Ratsa Ratsa, it's Ratsa Ben Akramim. Ratsa Bederech is not a kasha. Had the apple the gabe dabra. If it's running towards the outskirts of the city to the midbar, then it's an aveda. Had the apple the gabe masa. But if it's running towards the city, then it's not an aveda. So even though it's it's running bederech and running usually is a chesarin, here the direction of the where it's running to will go ahead and influence whether it's an aveda or not. It's running away from the city, it's an aveda. Running towards the city, not. Roya Roya Nami like Hasha. We said Roya is also that one Roya of we said it is an Aveda, one that says it's not an Aveda. Kamba Aveda is Gufa, right? That's when it's an Aveda. Kamba Aveda is Karka. Aveda is Gufa is the animal itself is going to go ahead, what? And get get the Kromim are going to go ahead and it's going to scratch the animal, right? It's going to go ahead, what? And, and, and scratch the animal. So the Abed this Gufa, when it went, you want to return the animal that it shouldn't get scratched up, right? That's it's an Aveda. Abedis Karka, right? Abedis Harzari Aveda. Abedis Karka, when it comes to go ahead, what? That the animal, it can, where it's not an Aveda, that's being an Abedis Gufa. It's not an Aveda when, when, about the animal itself. But when it's an Aveda, when the animal would destroy the land, then it's a problem in the land. In other words, Roya was said, Roya Bikramim. It's not an Aveda. That's vis to be the animal. When you're worried about the animal. When is it an Aveda? When you're worried about the land being destroyed, when the land be, the being trampled on. Kikatani, Roya Bederech, Loi Havi Aveda. The Gemara explains. Kikatani, Roya Bederech, Loi Havi Aveda. It's Roya Bederech, it's not Aveda. I, I, I learned, what did I say? Roya Bekromim is, is Roya Bekromim. Yeah. Kikitani, Roya Bederach Leav Aveda, Ha Roya Bena Krom, Havi Aveda, Vavedis Karka. That's when it's Aveda, it's going to destroy the land. Therefore, what? You have to take the animal out. The Kikitani, Rotsa Bena Kromim, Havi Aveda. And when you said it's Rotsa Bena Krom, Havi Aveda, Ha Roya Bena Kromim, Loy Havi Aveda. Again, the Roya Roya is, is speaking about Aveda's group for the animal itself. You want to save the animal. The Ratsa Ben Akromim Shev Miskava. When it's Ratsa Ben Akromim, it's going to get scratched up. The Roya Ben Akromim Loy Miskava. So it's Roya, it's not going to get scratched up. Fred the Gemara, the Roya Ben Akromim Nehid Loy Miskava. Good if it's grazing and not running, it's not going to get scratched up. Typically, Mishum Avedis Kark, it's still going to destroy the land. So you're telling me Roya Ben Akromim is not an Aveda. I, because you're not worried about it getting scratched up, but what about destroying the land? Said the Gemara, but the Kuti, the land belongs to a guy. Let's say what the, the animal itself, the, the, the Dilma, the Dilma Kotle, if it's the land of so Bishlema, if it's the Jewish land, we're not worrying about it scratched up, is one thing. You, if it's a Roya Ben Akramim, why aren't we worried about destroying the land? It's the Kuti's land. The Kuti sees the or sees the animal, is going to kill the animal. Forget about scratched up, it's going to kill the animal. The Dilma Kotle says, Worry about Asra the Master of the Hoda Kotle. It's peace that what they, they warn you before they kill him. The Dilma Asraba, right? Says well, maybe what they did warn. He says, Asraba, Valayas Daraba, he doesn't listen, Vade Aveda Midasi, then he bad Veda Midas. So the Gemara wants to go ahead and answer up that we thought that what that you need both Milas in order both Khasar uh, in order to be uh Roya Bikra uh, Roya Bidarak's great, right? Ratsa Bikramim, everyone agrees, right? Uh Ratsa Ratsa. Ratsa Bikramim is two miles. Ratsa Bederech, it depends on the direction. Roya Bikramim, it depends on what? It depends on the animal itself. 
or it depends on the land itself. The animal, it's not a problem. In the land, it is a problem. That's you know, a little little involved Gemara, but Baruch Hashem. Chachsiru Baruch, Chachsiru Baruch, right? You have to return it a bunch of times. The Gemara now, guys, is very digressing. We're going to go through every single place in Shas where we have double the shyness. We're going to go through every single place in Shas where we have double the shyness. So it's a, really a, a true digression, but very fascinating. So we said, if it runs away, it runs away. You have to return it even four or five times because it says, Hashav to Shivang. So Dove says, what's the what's Pshad Hashav to Shivang? It says it twice. You have to go ahead and return it because it says it twice. Let's say Hashav is one time. To Shivang comes Trezimni two times. Why do you say four or five times? So Amale, so this is why I was not so uh this I was not so listening to you, Dove. I'm sorry. Amale, Rabbi says, Hashav Afilu Meyapam in Mashma. Hashav is Mashma Filo a hundred times. To Shivam, Sha'inli El Lebesai, that I only have to return it to his house. Liginasa Lukhurvasai Minai, and how do I can return it to his garden or his korva? Tamalaima to Shive Mikal Makan. It says what? To Shive Mikal Makan. Okay, the Rambam in the Pierce of Mishmayas explains the following. Hashev is mashma, return it. It means return it once, twice. It doesn't make a difference. It says return it. It's the word like Zohar. Zohar is Yom HaShabbat. Zohar says it once, but we know we do it all the time. That's the Rambam. And so according to this, he's learning from the word, right? He's learning what? From what? From the word Hashev itself. Therefore, to Shivim is extra to teach me this din of Ashava, that by Aveda, you can return it what? in in uh, in this way. Now we know there's certain ways to return things, fellas. Let's say you steal something, you steal something. This is dinner shavas aveda pikodon. You're returning a pikodon, and we had the sugi about returning something. Do you need das or not? So here's the here's the gemara. Okay, the gemara says the following: Hechi dami. What exactly are you speaking about? The shivim over here. If the place he's returning it to pshita, why do I need a pasik? you returned it. He's watching it. And if it's a place that is not watched, am I? Then why is it considered returning? Correct? So in other words, what is the Shiva I'm teaching me? says the Mintra. It's a place that's watched. The Hakamash Balon, the Lay Bean and Das Bailam. In other words, if the field is fenced in, you don't need a Das Bailam to say you returned it. By Geneva, you need Das Bailam. By Picard, you need Das Bailam. By Aveda, you would not need Das Bailam. The Omar, Hakold Srikham Das Bailam. Ganev, Gazlin, the four Shoimim, when you return it to them, you need Das Bailim, the only Das Bailim. Chutz me Hashavas Aveda, with the exception of Hashavas Aveda, why Sha Torah Ripsa Hashavas Harbe. By the word to Shivim, the Torah is Marbe Wat many times. So the Gemara now says Hashav we're learning out the, the multiple times, and to Shivim, that by Aveda you can return it as long as it's a place that's Mishkaner, even if there's no Das Bailim, it's considered by the good Hashava. Okay, now the digression. In the Torah, it says, Shalech the Shalach has the aim, Besabonim Tikach Loch, the Manita Vloch Arach the Yomim. This is the din of Shluch Hakim. The din of Shluch Hakim. Now it says, Shalech the Shalach. Ema Shashalach, Chod Zimna, you go ahead and, and, and save it or uh, send it one time. Tishalach, Trey Zimni. Right? If it comes back, you go ahead and send it, send it away one more time. But you're not Machuyev to send it away more than two times before you take the birdies. So Amar lay, so Rav said, Shaleach is a filu meyapam in mashma. The word shaleach is means you have to send it away a hundred times. Tishalach teaches me she'ain loy ella l'devarishus that you have to send it away with for a devarishus. But let's say it's a devar mitzvah. For example, the mitzvah you need the bird for what for mitzvah minayin that then also you still have to send away what the mother, right? It's and even though you need the birds for a mitzvah. Even for the bar mitzvah, you have to send away the mother. You might think for the bar mitzvah, you don't have to send away the mother before you take the birds. Kamash Malon, that you have to still send away the mother. Okay. In the Torah, it says, what? Do not hate your friend in your heart. You should give him musr. And you should not carry what? A chet. Right? You shouldn't carry a chet. So what does it say? I'm a who... It says, the one time, 
Right? But more than that, you don't have to give Teichacha. Amalei, Rabbi says, Hacheich afilu mei apamim, even a hundred times. Mashma Teichiach, she'en li ela harav le Talmud. That's the Rebbe to the Talmud. Talmud l'rav minai, and how even the Talmud can give Teichacha to the Rebbe, Talmud Leimar, Hacheich Teichiach mikal makan. Okay, the Rifra points out it has to be Derech Kovit. Like Rebbe, it says in the Torah, something, in other words, Teichacha, it's not to turn to Rebbe and say, you know, Rebbe, you did something wrong. You know, Rebbe, the, I think the Ramban says, Bismana say, Baruch stop. The Bismana I think that uh, there's no, uh, the, I think it's Ramban. Who wrote, Ramban lived in the 1200s, that there's no Techacha. No one takes Techacha anymore. You give Techacha, yeah, yeah. It, it, it's, it's, you have to, Shem Shemayim, it's, it's not, not, Zalo Pashut. Zalo Pashut. You have to do it in a very, you really want to do it, guys. It has to be away from people when people are calm and, and, and you have to know that the person's going to take it. If not, I think the person, try telling a person to stop talking at Shul. It's, it's not, not so posh. Okay. Now, uh, the next din, if you see the chamor of your enemy, it's lying underneath its load. Do not go ahead and, and, and help it, stop from helping him. Azev Tazavimo, again, the Lushen of Azev Tav. The fascinating Gemara, beautiful Gemara, the constant repetition lines and shots. Azev Tazavimo, Lushen Kafula, Enli Ella Baola Vimo. It says, only if the owner's helping you do you have to go ahead and help him uh, unload. Shame Bola Vimo, if the Baal is not there helping you, Minayan, that you have to unload it. Hamad Loimar, Azev Tazav Mikomakan. It says, even when the Baal is not helping you, you unload the animal. Now, the Pusik says, by the set in the other pasuk, leisiris kamar chichay shari noiflim baderech for salam to mehem. Don't write. Hakim takim imoy. You should go ahead and hakim takim imoy. This is the mitzvah of to, to mitzvah of loading the animal. Mitzvah of loading the animal. Hakim takim imoy. Ain liela bola vimoy. Let's say shein bola vimoy. Nayin tamalei ma hakim takim mikol makin. Why do we need two, 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 one by loading and one by unloading? By unloading and one by loading. So tricha, because Rachmana prika by going ahead and you're right and unloading the animal, unloading the animal. Havamina mishum diiket sar bali chayim. The animal is overloaded. The kisar and kiss that what that the chamor is going to be damaged. Avol teina but loading the animal. The lav sar bali chayim mika. The lech kisar and kiss mika. Aim aloy. I would think you're not chayim. If you tell me to load, I say Mishum de Bishar, because he has to pay you. I will preka de Bechinam Aim Aloy. So we should tell me in both cases that what is a mitzvah. For the Gemara of Shimon de Omar, Sha'af to Ina Bechinam, that even not only is, he doesn't, it's even to Ina, you get for nothing, you don't get paid. So what's the reason you have to tell me both? But Shimon de Misai Mikra, the Pesukim Wat is not Misai Mikra. Rashi, Toysa Springs, fellas, that you don't know which one it's speaking about. You don't know according to Tois, according to Tosis, you're not exactly sure which one uh, is speaking about. Uh, I'm going to read a, a paraphrase of Tosis. Shemash of Neiflin Baderech, you see it fall in Baderech. So Pashas, you see, you think that the load is on it, and therefore why it's it's falling down. It says, "Is Hakim Tuck and get it up?" We can we can go ahead and explain it. Shneiflin Ima Masa Shalayim. It fell with the load or the load. It's Sarich Lefari Gesemasa, and you have to take off the load. And that says Roivitz Tachas Maso. That's and and then it says Azuk Tavoi. We can go ahead and explain that what there, there, uh, there's not a lot of people over there to help him load. So you can go ahead what and 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 Machmed Hamas Al Behema Roivetzes. So Toisha says you can go ahead and Taich Eats Pasik another way. You could Taich Eats Pasik to mean that one is speaking about Prika, one is speaking about Tina. So you don't know which which way. You don't know which way. So therefore you say both. Therefore you say both. So you don't need a trichasa. You need both to tell me that exists in both venues. Yeah, says the Gemara. Why do you have to tell me prekutina? Why do you learn from the other? Why do you need to tell me uh, these two and Aveda? All this speak, speaking about saving the money of your friend. Each one, right? They're all speaking about saving money. So why do you need to tell me you save him by loading, you save him by unloading, or you return an Aveda? That's a trichasa. Loading and unloading and Aveda. I would say Dafka Precantina Yachayim Mishum. It's Syro de Mora Issa because he has a lot of Tsar. There's Tsar to him, right? He's not able to load or unload. Syro de Day Issa and the Tsar of the animal. Tsar de Do. So you have 
by prikutina, you have to of the animal and of the person. Avala Veda, the Tsar the Mara Isa, the Tsar Dida Lesa, there's no Tsar to the animal. Amai would say that why you're not hired to return the animal. Viashmin Aveda and not Prikutina, I would say Mishum the Lesa Lamara Bahada, because the Baalbad is not there to help you, and therefore that's why you have to return it. I mean, I'll abase. Avalhani Tarti, but Prikutina, where the owner is there, the Isa Lamara Bahada, Amaloi, I would say you don't have to help him. Kamash Mansricha, that you need to help him. Okay, some more psukim with double shyness. Okay, in the parsha of Ritzicha, when you kill a murderer, it says you kill a murderer by the, the age old beheading, what we call Hereg. Mois Yumas Hamake, it says you kill him. Mois Yumas, only Ella the Misa Haksuvalo. I would say Dafke Becher if you kill him. Minayim Shem Yatu Yochel Misa the Misa Haksuvalo. If you can't kill a mat with a Cherev, that why are you able to kill him? That's by throwing, shooting an, by shooting an arrow at him or something else. Shata B'Shoi La Misa, you're able to kill him in that way. But the Chol Misa Shata Yochel La Misa Tamad Leimar Mois Yumas Mikol Machem. You go ahead and kill him any which way. Okay, the pasuk says by. By the parsha of Irni Dachas, it says, "Hakasakas Yeshvei Yerahi Lefichara." But Irni Dachas is a city where the majority of the Jews, uh, the Jewish city, and the majority of the Jews were over by the Zara. So it says, "Hakasake," only, and that's also becherev. Only Ella behaka haksuba behen. Minayin shemato yochel amisam behaka haksuba behen. Shatu b'shoy la koysam b'chol akos shatu yochel talmud leimar hakasake b'chol makan. Okay, now it says leinim by halva. It says by Abba, you take a mashkin and you return the mashkin to Bohashemesh. It says, Hashiv Tashiv, you return the mashkin. I would say you only return a mashkin that Bezdin, the Shlicha Bezdin, went and took the mashkin to secure your loan. Mishkin Bezdin, let's say you yourself went into his house and took it, Minayan, that you have to return it. You go ahead, man, and you return it anyway. Well, that does have like that. Uh, again, it says by Mashkin a well, the Pusik says, Chobal Tachbo, Salmas Vayach, Advaya Shemesh de Shibenu, Sheinli Ella, the Gemara's going to ask why you need both. Sheinli Ella, Shemishkanai Bereshus, that the Shleich Bezdin was toughest. Mishkanai Shleich Bereshus Bezdin, let's say you type the Shleich Bereshus Bezdin, Minayin, Tamadlema, Chobal Tachbo, Mikom Mokan, Bahani Trey Kroy Lamali, why do you need these two Pusukim? Chad Kasus Yoim. The chad lukasus lila. One pasuk to tell me that you turn his pajamas, the other one turn his work clothes. Psoyach tiftach. This is speaking by giving tzedakah. It says what? Keep psoyach tiftach es yotcha v'habit havidenu daimach soyra. You give him his basic need. Psoyach tiftach sheinli ella laaniye ircha. I would say only the people of your city. Laaniye ircha cheres tamalayim. Psoyach tiftach bechol makayim any ani. Pasuk says by tzedakah. Nothing. He tain loy v'leyera levavcha besitcha loy sheinli ella matana maruba. I would say you only matana maruba, because in the pasuk it says, guys, it says nothing. He tain loy v'leyera levavcha besitcha loy ki beglal hadav azeh yerech Hashem lekech b'chol ma'aseh b'chol ma'at mishlach. By giving tzedakah, Hashem blesses you. So you might think that what sheinli ella matana maruba. Ach matana mu'at is denying that you should give me matana. Uh, right, she. If you don't have matana maruba, you give him a small matana. Tamalayim and us and tite mikol makayim, even a small matana. By hanako, if it, once the evidence worked for you for, for six years, you have to send them away with 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 gifts. Hanik tanik sheinli elishin is baruch habayis begoloi, because the pasuk says hanik tanik loy mitzaincha umigarcho mikvecha asheb beracha hashem lekecha tite loy. So I would say what hanik tanik sheinli elishin is baruch habayis begoloi. Let's say during your time he was with you, you didn't do so well so financially. Even if your house was not blessed. Only if you were financially successful during his duration by you, then you give Hanukkah, but if not, not. What do you have to say? The Torah speaks Kolashim Ben Yadam. Now, according to this, why don't you say the whole Gemara? The Torah speaks Kolashim Ben Yadam, right? Right. So the Tosfos addresses it, and the Pasuk speaks over here, right? Says Tosfos in Toimar, he lest lehu kol hani truashes de leel halibud of Shimon Mishanina nami leel de loy misayim akra who be Rosh Hashanah darish nami akaviyesh leimar the dafka hocha bahani trei kroy these two Pasukim we're going to see the second one in a second. I mean in Dibur Torah Kolashim Ben Yadam because it's Mishun Mechiach Kroy de Ksiv Daimach Soiroy. 
Guys, look at if, if you have to look them on the side, look what it says. Hanik Tanik Loy Mitsoincha Migarcha, give him gifts from your from your tsoin, umigarcha from your goyrin from your threshing floor, umikvecha from your wine press. I should be racha shemalakecha. It's mashma guys in the pasuk. Why should you give him? Because I should be racha Hashem. Hashem has blessed you during this time. And so Dibra Dibra Tarik Lashem Adam. That that's why he says that you're going to give him only why because Hashem blessed you. So therefore Dibra Tarik Lashem Adam. And the other pasuk that's going to speak about tzedak in a second. We'll see in a second. It says Daim Achsori. You give him a little bit. So since within the pasuk itself you have a heichacha like that, that's why you say Dibra Tarik Lashem Adam. But some of the other places where there was no heichacha in the pasuk, we had to leave more than we had. It's a very good, very good thesis. Okay, now next pasuk, havit havit tenu. So the pasuk said, "But mitzvah of halva." It says we turn the mashkin. She'ein li elke she'ein loy, right? Uh, you you have to she'ein loy to give the ani elke she'ein loy. He doesn't have. Let's say the ani does not have what to take. Then you give him. Ve'in writes the spanis mitzedaka that then you give him a gift. Ama kro havit tein lo derech halva. In other words, having means to give him a halva, correct? So I would think this guy doesn't have money to live. Really, he needs tzedakah, but he's so proud. So then you give him a halva. But Yeshloi, how do you know if he does have money to be parnas and he doesn't want to go ahead and be parnas from himself? How do you know that what that you have to give him? Even where he has Yeshloi, has, you should give him. Where he does have and he doesn't want to be misparnas. How do you know you don't have to give him halva? Why do you have to say lashon of halva? And again, this is what the first part of Taisus, where the pasuk said that what that you only have to give him where he has his basic needs. Once he doesn't have his basic needs, you don't have to give him a loan. So only these two scenarios by Hanaka and by halva, where the pasuk says that be by what by Hanaka and by what by by loans, then we say Okay, how you bottle misella? Let's say the, the Mishnah had said if he's bottle from from work, bottle misella, lo yom elatenli sella. He can't say give me the amount total recompensation. El nice nice skarik kipoil. Now what poil are we talking about? So it says megmar tana nice la skarik kipoil bottle. Now poil bottle is mashma the following: how much a person would be willing to go ahead what and take not to do anything to sit around like 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 a, like a nothing. My kipoil bottle, amabaya kipoil bottle shoyse malacha. The bottle mina, meaning he doesn't want to get total unemployment. He wants to get kipoil bottle from a particularly hard malacha. How much a person would go ahead and pay to do this, get, to not to do this easier job rather than do the harder job? Not to not do anything, right? That's what it's telling you, right? That's what it's, that's what it's telling you. Look at Rashi. Look at Rashi. My kapal bottle, but halay ain't a bottle. He's not being bottle. So tereach b'shavasa. He's being tereach going ahead and returning your your lost item. Umaslis antoni noisem lo kishir sheroitza poyel lio lehis rapois nimalacha v'leishe bottle. And it's mashma that what how much a person would be sit, willing to sit and do nothing. So it's it's a it's a counterintuitive. He's doing something, and you tell me how much he'd be willing to pay to do nothing. So the, on that, the Gemara answers, Kipoil bottle me oisim alacha, says Rashi. Kipoil bottle me oisim alacha. Kam adam roitz alita of a lich slice mischare, how much he would be willing to take less of an amount, li bottle me alacha zuk feda, shu oisik ba, to leave. Let's say he's, 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 he's laying bricks, or he's, or he's schlepping things. How much he'd be willing to go ahead and not lay the bricks and return that velasik malacha kala kazu to return to Aveda. Hakolafi koivin amalacha, everything will go according to the heaviness of the load, the ribi schar in the amount of, of the malacha shetarcha. Kal. So it's kishmak, guys. In other words, you say when you say kipoil bottle, you know what that means? A guy doing nothing. A guy doing nothing. He's doing nothing. One second. You can't say that over here. He's doing something. He's going to return the stuff, right? He's doing something. So therefore, let's go ahead and fine-tune kipoil bottle. It doesn't mean bottle completely. It means bottle from the particular difficult malacha he's busy with now, rather than doing the easy malacha of returning the Aveda. Okay? Kishma. Okay, you got it now? Good. Says the Gemara Baita. Isser vira im yeshba shon bezdin masim fneyem. If you have Bezdin, you can make the condition in front of the Bezdin, right? We make a condition in front of Bezdin to say that well, you want to get more money. You don't want to get Kipoil Bottle. 
Isav Rav Safra, a person named Isser and Rav Safra, Ovid Iska Bahadi Adadi. They made an ASIC, they had a business venture between them. Azul Rav Safra, Polig Labeloy Daite de Isser. He went ahead and he divided up the assets, but Ape Betray without Isser's knowledge in front of two people. So Rav Safra would, had a partnership with what? With Isser. He, he would dissolve the partnership. He, he, he took his assets, not in front of Isser, in front of two people, and divided it up. Also, coming to Rav Rav Huna, Isser was not happy with this, and he bought Rav Safra in front of Rav Huna for a din taira. Amalei, so he told him, right? So, so uh, Amalei, So Amalei, Rabbi Rav Huna told Rav Safra, Zil I see Talasa de Palak de Kamayu. Go bring the three people who were experts that you went ahead and divided it in front of. He told him, bring the three people. Inami or else, um, Amin Aleph, Inami or else, Tre Migoy Tulsa, two of the three that you divided up in front of. The Inami, Tre Sadi, two Edis, the Palak de Ape Bey Tilsa that you divided in front of three. So Rabbi Rav Huna was not having Rav Safra's two people as a as as a as a, a reliable source of division. He needed three like our Mishnah. He needed three like our Mishnah. So either bring the three or two of the three to testify that we there are three or two two to testify in front of three. But either way, he wasn't going with two. So Amalei Rav Safra told Rabbi Rav Huna, Menolachav, how do you know this? So Amalei. So Rabbi Rav Huna told him that Nan, we learned in the Mishnah, that in Yesh Shon Bezdin, if you have a Bezdin, Masnim if Nehem, go ahead, Mad, and make the condition in front of Bezdin. And in Shon Bezdin, then what? If Nehemi Yisna, shall like hide them and don't return it. But you see from here, you need three people. Omer of Safra said, Me, dummy, how can you complain? How can you compare the, 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 the dissolving of a partnership to an Aveda? Right? I'm dissolving a partnership, and that is speaking about an Aveda. Now, what's his svara? What's this? What's the svara? Hasam by mitzia, dimafik min moine mehai umoisib lahai. You're taking money from the person that what that lost it, and you're giving it to the one who found it. Being in bezdin, there you need a bezdin. Avol hacha di shakli. All I'm doing is taking what's rightfully mine. I'm a shudif. So gili milsa ba almahu that there was a division. Who betray sagile and it's enough too. You don't need bezdin. So Teda, what's the Raya? Almana. Well, guys, one of the Tanaik Suba is the Almana gets fed from the estate as long as she lives in the, the house of the of the deceased or she doesn't collect a Ksuba. We all remember that from Ksubas. So we have a Raya. Almana, who is being uh, sustained by the estate, Moicheris can go ahead and sell property for her Mizainis. Shalai Bifnei Bezdin. So you see, when it's rightfully yours, just like the almana, this should this was rightfully mine, and therefore two should suffice, says our Safa to Rabba Rav Huna, and I shouldn't need three. So Amalei Abaya, <clears throat> Abaya goes ahead, and he's doyker Rav Safra, Allah me itmar Allah. Do we not learn that Amr Rav Yosef Bar Minyumi Amr Rav Nachman almana ain't tzricha bezdin, right? Shal mumchin, she does need a bezdin of mumchin. Aval tzricha bezdin shall had yoytis, she does need a bezdin of yoytis. A bezin of Yotis in the in the vinyl line is what is three and not two. Therefore, you were incorrect in going ahead and dividing it up in front of, of two. Okay, let's uh, say Tehillim.